Hello YouTube. Um, I recently got an Elgato HD 60S Plus, so that's the Plus, not the HD 60. Um, if you're anything like me, you've been having problems with them to do with the sound. So I'm getting no sound um, when it's hooked up. Uh, for this example, I'm using a Nintendo Switch. Um, so HDMI works visually, but no sound comes through to the computer, which I stream off. Um, now, uh, I have plugged it into my girlfriend's laptop and found that it works perfectly, but unfortunately I don't use that for streaming, I need it to work on my computer. I have been in contact with Elgato, they're trying to sort it out. Um, you might be in the same situation and wondering how you can work around it uh, in the meantime to at least use it until that's um, fixed. So uh, what I'm going to do is run you through a little workaround I've got. What you'll need is uh, one headphone cable. So um, basically it's the cable that goes into the headphone jack of the switch. Uh, it needs to have both ends on it, so it's the same on each side. And what we're going to do is plug that into the headphone spot on the switch, and we're going to plug that then into the microphone in or the mic in um, port on your uh, computer. Once you've done that, I'll show you a quick picture. So it should come up looking like this. Okay, you should plug it in like that. That's the ends you need. As you can see here, we've got uh, my switch playing. Okay, um, but there's no sound here. Nothing coming through. Okay, no reason, no idea why that's happening. I've been through all the sound drivers. I've reinstalled everything. I've um, even used a, as you can see here, a USB analyzer to check that the data that's coming through is uh, coming through without issues. It is. Um, the tech support aren't sure what it is. So you're probably having the same problem, no sound. So what we do is we've got it all plugged in. Okay, so once that's all plugged in, you're still not gonna have any sound. What you need to do next is go to here, right click, go open sound settings, which is open on my other screen. There we go. Okay, next what you need to do is go to sound control panel. Now that that's loaded up, next step is recording and you should find the microphone. So here is the microphone uh, for that device. So now what I'll do is I will click on that, double click, go to listen. Listen to this device and you want it to play back on your default playback device or whatever that might be for you, speakers for me. Click listen and apply. And now you can hear we have sound. There is a little bit of humming. Um, I believe you can get a um, some sort of something to put in the line there to stop the humming. I just turn the volume down a bit, turn my stream music up, and you can't really hear it too bad. Um, but as you can hear, um, there is now sound coming through for the stream, so I can at least use it in the meantime uh, until that's all sorted. So I hope that uh, helps um, with your problem. And uh, we'll see you next time.